Hello again, this is Captain John with another one of my video tips of the week. In today's video tip, we're going to take a look at the danger bearing. If you need to pass a danger, you can plot a danger bearing, and this defines how far you can be off course before you need to change course back toward safe water. First thing you want to do is always choose an object forward of the danger. Here you can see our shoal is on the starboard side, and we choose a tank on the far side of the shoal. Next thing you want to do is draw a line straight back from that object and we've taken that prominent object or the tank and we draw a line straight back toward our course line. Here you can see we've drawn our line off the outermost edge of the shoal and that's very important. Plot and label the danger bearing. Here we found the danger bearing to be 045 degrees magnetic. We've used the abbreviation NLT for our danger bearing, which means not less than 045 degrees magnetic. If you have danger bearings on the port side of the boat, you would use the abbreviation NMT, which means not more than the danger bearing. Remember this rule never changes. NLT for dangers on the starboard side, NMT for dangers on the port side. As we proceed along our sailing course to the cove, we'll start to take bearings over our steering compass, or we could use a hand bearing compass. As long as those bearings stay 045 degrees magnetic or greater, we are in safe water. But if at any time those bearings are less than 045 degrees magnetic, we need to change course back towards safe water. For dangers to port, you follow the same procedure, but remember to label your bearing line NMT, which stands for not more than. That means if you shoot a bearing at any time and your bearing is more than the danger bearing line, you would want to change course right away towards safe water. Use easy sailing navigation tips like these to keep your small sailboat in safe water and your crew safe and sound. This is Captain John, and this has been another one of my video tips of the week. Find more sailing tips and techniques on www.skippertips.com.